Hello everyone, welcome to Pabli Connect. So in this video we will learn how to integrate Salesforce and Trello. So our use case is pretty simple. When a new task is created in Salesforce, it will automatically create a card in Trello. Now Salesforce is an awesome CRM tool and Trello is a list building application. So what we are going to do is, we are going to send the data from Salesforce to Trello. But there is one minor problem. Of course, there is some kind of integration between Salesforce and Trello. But this native integration is actually very limited. So in cases like these, we need to bring a third app to properly connect them both. So in this video, we will be using Pabli Connect to integrate Salesforce and Trello. And the best part of using Pabli Connect is, there is no need for coding skills or programming knowledge. It can be done easily. Let me show you on my screen. Okay, so to begin the process, first type pabli.com in your browser. pabli.com. Press enter. Okay, so this is the website of pabli.com. Here hover on products and at the bottom you will find the option called as connect. Click on connect and then click on sign in. Okay, so this is the dashboard of pabli connect. As you can see, I already have made an account in Pabli Connect. You can also create your own free account in just two minutes. Here, I would like to mention one more thing that Pabli Connect offers a plan where this integration can be tried out absolutely free. So you just have to clone the template of its workflow, which is available in the description box. Once you clone the template, you will get immediate access to this amazing workflow in your account. Okay, so scroll down and at the bottom you will find connect. Here, click on access now. Okay, so at the top right corner, you will find a button, create workflow, click this, a dialog box appears in front of you. I am going to give it as Salesforce to Trello, Salesforce to Trello. Okay, then just click on create. Okay, so when you click on create, a window appears in front of you. This is called as the trigger window. So in the choose app, how about we make it as Salesforce? because we want to send the data from Salesforce, that is why. Now in the trigger event, how about we make it as new task. Now new task is basically a trigger event. So your obvious question is, what is a trigger event? Trigger is basically a if statement. It asks a question, if the condition is met, what should be done? For example, if a new task is created, then what action should be taken by the system? Actually, there are more trigger events like new lead and so on. However, in case if you don't find the trigger of your choice, you can make a request to our team at admin at the rate for the specific trigger that you want to build. But at present, I just want to send the data when a new task is made in Salesforce. Okay, so click on connect with Salesforce. Okay, in the new credentials, just again click on connect with Salesforce. Okay, so Pabli Connect is demanding access. So just click on allow. Okay, so it is showing the authorization is successful. Just click on OK. Okay, so basically the gist of the process is we are just trying to integrate Salesforce and Pabli Connect. And uh, we actually have integrated uh, Salesforce and Pabli Connect. So what we have to do here is uh, we just go to Salesforce and create a task. And imagine this, I already have created a task. Okay, so the Pabli Connect, just click on save and send test request. So when we click on save and send test request, it will show the data of the last task that we have created in Salesforce. Let me show you. So I'm just clicking on sales, save and send test request. Okay, so as you can see, it is showing the last task that was made. Okay, so the last task was made as called as the Tesla purchase. Okay, and uh, the priority was normal and the status is uh, not started yet. Okay, so basically it has fetched the details of the last task. Okay, so let me create one more task. Okay, so I'm going to create a task in Caspersia. Okay, so this is the contact and I'm going to create a new task in Caspersia. So the task name is uh, fishing. Okay, this is the task and the due date is set for uh, 22. And the contact name is Sia Casper. Excellent. So I'm just going to click on create. Okay, so a task called as fishing has been created. So let me go to Pabli Connect and let me again click on save and send test request. Okay, so it is showing. Okay, so where is our task? 
okay so it is showing the subject as fishing okay and this is the due date excellent okay so now we are ready to sync all this detail to trello so to do that all you have to do is just click on this plus button okay so when you click on this plus button another window opens up this is called as the action window so in the choose app how about we make it as trello because we want to create a card in trello that is why now in the action event how about we make it as add new card so add new card is the action event there are many more action events like create a board create a list on a board invite member to a board get card details and so on however just like the triggers if you don't find the action event according to your choice you can contact us at admin at the rate family.com to custom build an action event for you but at present i just want to create 10 card in trello okay so just click on connect with trello so in the new credentials we have three blanks to fill the username the api key and the token so to get this detail just click on here okay so this is your api key simply copy this and just paste it here so we have pasted our api key so we want our username and the token so to get the username and the token just click on token here click this okay so basically this is your username copy this and just paste it here okay now coming for the token scroll down and just click on allow so basically it will generate a token so this is your token copy this and simply paste it here okay so we have entered the username we have entered the api key and also we have entered the token so just click on save okay so when you click on save a set of blanks has appeared in front of you the purpose of this blank is very simple we are going to create a in a particular list in trello we are going to create a card from the data that we have received from salesforce via public connect so for example in the choose board it is showing alpha board now when we expand this it is showing many different boards like gold moonstruck yellow testing all of them are bunch of boards present inside trello let me show you okay so as you can see these are all the boards i have moonstruck gold and so on so basically any data that is present here will be reflected here because we have integrated trello to public connect so i'm going to uh, create a card in this particular board called as moonstruck so i'm selecting the board as moonstruck okay okay so in the moonstruck we have uh, three list okay so these are the three list i have crater apollo and the south pole so as you can see when we select uh, click on expand so we have the three list that is crater apollo and the south pole so we are going to create a list how about uh, in the south pole or how about we add another list so we are going to add a list called as north pole okay so we have added the list called as north pole so when we refresh this here okay so it will show a new list called as the north pole okay so the idea is that there is a board called as moonstruck and there is a list called as north pole so we are going to uh, create a card in this board called as moonstruck and we are, are going to create a, a card in this list called as north pole excellent so in the name of the card we are just going to map the details that we have received from salesforce so this button is called as the mapping button click this okay so the name of the card was uh, name of the task was fishing so i'm just basically going to enter that similarly in the description of the card we are just going to enter a description or how about we enter the due date no we don't have the due date so the date was this one activity date okay so we have entered the name of the card and in the description of the card we have entered the activity date and uh, if we want we can enter the person that it was uh, created for it was created for pavli or sia sia johnson no it is not showing okay so that is enough for the description of the card we are just going with the activity date okay so the name of the card is uh, fishing and it is in the list north pole and it is in the port called as moonstuck so just click on save and send test request okay so the api response is showing that the data has been given to trello so let's have a look in trello whether we have a card called as fishing yes as you can see in the list there is a list called as north pole and inside this list called as north pole there is a card called as fishing so the presence of this card shows that we have successfully integrated uh, uh, salesforce and trello with help of public connect so how about we double check if our integration is working fine or not but before we do that let me show you the whole gist of the process so let me take you back to public connect and let me minimize my action window and let me minimize my trigger window okay so basically this is the whole process in a nutshell first you integrated salesforce to public connect and then you integrated public connect to trello so now there's a perfect flow of data between salesforce and trello excellent so now we are going to create one more task in salesforce so i'm going to select some contact 
okay so we are going to assign a task for example Markle John so he is going to assign a task and the subject is hunting and the due date we are uh, selecting is as uh, 25th and just click on create okay so hunting task has been created by John Markle so let's have a look in Trello whether we have a task called as hunting okay so let me refresh this okay so after waiting five or five or six minutes i got the task called as hunting so do remember that uh, salesforce actually take a significant amount of time to send the data so you actually have to wait five or six minutes so we do have a task called as hunting in this particular list called as north pole and this is inside this board called as moonstuck excellent so our integration is working absolutely fine this means anytime a new task is assigned in salesforce it will be reflected as a card in trello not just these two apps you can integrate up plenty of applications using Pabli Connect. If you have any queries, contact us at admin at the rate pabli.com. Our dedicated team members will help you to automate your workflows. Or better, just visit our website www.pabli.com. It's awesome. Thanks.